Legend of Total War here, and today we've got another saving disaster campaign. This time we're playing the Teutonic Order during the Teutonic campaign, and this is a true clusterfuck right here. Um, so, let's let's start with settlements. He's lost most of his territory that he started off with, only leaving it with Thorn, Marienburg, which is going to fall, and Konigsberg, which may not fall. I look forward to um, we have no army. We have one unit of Prussian archers there. A beaten up army here, and basically nothing here. That's it, that's all we've got. Your will shall be obeyed. Um, we've got no money, and well, at least we got some agents here. How may I say? Ready to trade. And he's not even, he's not even on a trade resource, so. Ready to trade. Things are not good. Yes, In addition to that, yes. his enemy is resource. very, very powerful by comparison. So. It's going to be some hard work to get this one turned around because there's there's a lot of enemies in the area here and we don't have much to work with. And what makes matters worse, worse is that the Lithuanians are full of cavalry Battle units. If it was full of infantry, defense. I wouldn't be concerned. But because it's so full of cavalry, that's going to be tricky. Anyway, we just need to make do with what we've got. Now, since Marienburg is definitely going to fall, this building here will get looted out. So, might as well demolish it and get some money back. This building here... Get rid of that just because I don't want it, and you shouldn't be recruiting um, catapult and shit anyway. Um, they're not they're they're not useful. They're expensive. They slow you down the campaign map, and whilst they do help with sieges, it's just not worth it. Uh, anyway, it's gonna be get me a little bit out of debt. Now I don't want to demolish any of these other buildings because I I don't like scorched earth tactics. I only destroy the buildings that I wouldn't have wanted anyway. So. I intend to come back here and retake this. An honor to right, serve, is there anything else we can do? What about our missions? We've got to convert the population. We rewards rewarded with some of the best units currently available. That would be very good. What are we up to with here? God sir. It's at forty percent. All right. So we've only got fifteen percent to go. So that, that's good. Let's speed up this process here in Konigsberg. Next turn, I'll bring them over here and try and lift this siege. All right. Let's move on. So yeah, there was nothing I could have done there. I think what happened here is the settlement was under siege. He tried to lift the siege and it failed. Alright. Alright, so let's come here and we'll sally out. That way we only need to defeat this army here and not this one as well. Yes, Lord! Confronting the enemy! And it'll give us a chance as well to use the, like, the towers and maybe do a little bit of damage to that army. But, um, oh man, this is, this is a fuck up. <laughs> I've, I've never seen one. I think some of the, uh, the recent campaigns that I've been doing haven't been quite as fucked as, you know, as they can be. So, I don't know, some people have said that, oh, it's not a real disaster. <laughs> It's kind of frustrating, and I, I do get frustrated. It's only a, it's only a minority of people, but I mentioned this before: is that if if the campaign is not quite that fucked up, people go, "Oh, it's not a real disaster." At which point, I'm like, oh right, okay, so I shouldn't do it then. But if it's too fucked up, people go, "Oh, it's a fake disaster." It's just like, okay, where's the line? The line, th there's overlap on the lines. And I've, I've asked people to stop bloody doing, uh, to stop, you know, stop being the inquisitors of disaster campaign, right? I've looked at the, the faction rating. It doesn't seem like a, del des a uh, deliberate disaster, you know? Just stop it, right? If, if, and even if it is a deliberate disaster, it's an interesting scenario. Let's just do it anyway. And also some other things is that I think some people want me to do like, you know, do extra episodes on some of these, you know, they're like, oh, it's not really that fuck unfucked, you know, yeah, you, you got him from three settlements to six or something like that, you know, if you hand it back to him, he might still lose. Well, truth be told, if you take this into consideration, this one, right, he's lost most of his territory before turn 25. If I was to gain back his territory, all of the territory that he would have started off with and hand it back to him, based on his demonstrated skill level, he would lose all his territory again. However, if I was to go further than that and defeat Lithuania, which would take several episodes to do, what's the point in me doing that? Because then I've just won the campaign. 
You know, my job here is not to win the campaign for you, it's to give you a second chance. And if you're not good enough to 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 win after the second chance, well, you got to get better. That's all there is to it. I'm giving you a second chance. That's more, all I can give you. I'm not going to win the campaign for you. And so for this guy here, who demonstrated, you know, not a very good campaign, this gives him a second chance to, to, to get better. Try try some other strategies. Don't do the same things you did before. You can do it. You just, you got to get better. And the thing is, the thing is as well, when people, it's, it's usually, I, I think a lot of people who are sending me like Medieval 2 save files, right? They've only just started playing Medieval 2. The enemy 2, general lies right? dead. We have sent the core to hell. So they, they can't get any worse. Like, someone with a thousand hours in the game is not going to send me a campaign like this. You know, unless it's deliberate. Okay, I don't think you're going to need to just put it over there. Look how our but new people, absolutely. Runs. You know, if they're new to Total War, this is the first Total War game they've ever played. Or they're used to playing Total War Warhammer and then they come onto this and it plays very differently. Um, you know, they're going to do a bad job. Don't worry about it, you know. Just get, you know, it just takes practice. Not everyone has clocked a thousand hours on this game. And I do think that people just need to pull the stick out of their ass and, you know, consider that every now and again. And, again, you could be right. It could be a deliberate disaster. But, give people the benefit of the doubt, I think. I think that's only fair. You know, if there's evidence of sabotage, I'll call it out. If there isn't, fuck it. It's a good scenario. Let's just do it anyway. Alright, so what do we got coming in over here? So there's a few men in coming over this way. Yeah, see, this is the problem with, with Lithuania. Very hard to catch them. Already exhausted. Alright, uh, get inside the settlement. And we'll see what happens there. Good, thinning them out, that's all I really needed to do. Don't have to win this battle, a draw is good enough. Nice. Alright, I want you to come back out. See if we can draw their attention to come back a bit closer. Are they coming? Okay, good, 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 let them come. Okay, so if you up all the ammo there, that's fine. But if they're just gonna sit there, great, you know, free kills. So they're shooting at him, that's okay. Uh, don't even need to go to this formation, it's fine. Just like even two percent, just a little bit. No, I don't think that made any difference. It's actually looking like we might be able to win this.
The enemy are badly bloodied. They have lost half their men. There's obviously no need to go charging out just yet. While the towers are still getting some kills, why sacrifice our men unnecessarily? We're already badly outnumbered against the Lithuanians. We need to take every fucking free kill that we can get. We can't out-recruit them. We can't... We, uh, can't out-spend them. But I can certainly try to out-kill them. So gave that guys a bit of a chance to rest, All right? You come back out here. Just a little bit to see if we can get them a little bit closer. Get back inside. Good, yeah, we'll win this. The battle seems to be swinging in our favor. From such tidings does victory emerge. Another thing as well is if we just charged out there, these guys would probably rout as opposed to die. By killing them, we're getting them close to 85%. Alright, now they've, they've had enough of being shot. Yeah, look, one unit of Tartar Lancers there is not enough to stop us. Let's, let's get in there. And our guys had a decent rest. Well, watch out for Latvian crossbows. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. The enemy general flees like the coward he is. Strike hard and break the spirit of his army. Good. So we certainly took a little bit of damage, but it's only on the general's bodyguards, so they'll recover. But that was a decent army that we've crushed. The enemy Pretty sure we hit 85%. The enemy are yeah. utterly vanquished. Somewhat tempting to get the ransom, but it's also more tempting to kill them, I think. I don't want them coming back and annoying us. Manpower is a thing in this game, so... The more we kill, you know, that depletes their manpower. Although they would have considerable, given how many regions they've got. Which, let's have a quick look. Territory at least sitting around 13 or 14. That's quite a lot. An honor to serve, my lord. Orders, my king. Hmm. If I don't recruit here soon, the, the army from here is going to come down and and besiege it. Your will shall be obeyed. If it is the fight you wish, hmm. come closer. It's pretty good. Right, how are we going for religion here? Because those extra recruits for free would be good. So at this rate, it should take about three turns. All right, let's move on. At least I got some recruiting done. You just gain extra chivalry. Oh, that would have been him. No, not this one. Okay, good. Because he's the governor. All right, uh, let's see here. Battle will resolve our differences. Hmm. If it is a fight you wish, come closer. I'd like to get to Palango. Battle will resolve our differences. But we sort of can't get there while there's so many enemies. Like if we send our guys whatever's necessary to take this, not to mention there could be a full stack standing out here. 
<sighs> it's hard to do it without any intel. I don't have anything. Oh, they can't build brothels, can they? So I need to build the castle library to get spies. Ah, God damn it! All right. I look forward to fighting you. We shall not relent ever. Leave your mercy behind, men. We shall. Okay, easy enough to none. defeat them. Let's just deal with these armies one at a time. Try and clear the area. Thin out their manpower. If they keep bringing more guys in here in smaller armies, and we keep killing them, that's something. Alright, so let's utilize the archers here, thin them out a little bit, and the generals to go and hit them in the flank. Are they going to walk towards us? Yeah, okay. If we charge in on the general's flank there, you can see the guy right on the edge. If we kill him, that'll fuck up their morale. The enemy general lies dead. We have sent the core to hell. Oh yeah, just don't worry about it. Bad, look how our coward Good, that went well. Run. Those are some pretty powerful units. So to see them just break and die like that, it's good. That Captured 143 of, of them, which will execute to gain more dread. Mo, Mo, ask for a ransom. Nah. <laughs> This gives them a chance to meet up with another one of their armies and cause us more problems. That one there will be tricky to deal with. If it is a fight you wish, mm. come closer. An order. You should fear us coming, my enemy. They oh God, he's lost more battles than he's than won. Death. Jesus Christ. All right. Legend, I would appreciate it if you didn't blaspheme. <laughs> okay. Let's grab those two. That should be enough to defend against a reasonably large Lithuanian force. Of, yeah, cavalry force. The, those order spearmen are very good. I mean, we're still making some coins, so it's not that big of a deal. And these guys here, fighting them on the battlefield, it, it's just tricky. Actually, you know what? Those those three there is not a really good deal. Leave your mercy behind, men. We shall show them none. Because basically, we'll just focus on the the crossbows and the Tartar cavalry. Don't worry at all about the the Cuman horse archers, because I can't catch them. Once I've dealt with the other two, that other one will either run away, or we'll figure something else out there. Alright, so where is he? Yeah, so going straight for the, uh, the Latvian crossbows there. So they're going for the high ground, but they've left them behind. Are winning the battle. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Yeah, anything that we can do to just have the general's bodyguard, you know, win the battle or whatever for us. That's not too risky. That would be ideal because any casualties he takes can be recovered. We really need to build up our infantry army as much as possible. Because we've got the finances to support a much larger army than we've currently got. Just need time. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. Look how right. our cowards we'll, we'll never catch him, all so. civilized people. Couple of easy kills, you know, most of them did get away though. We can't catch them, so just let them go. Why? There is no need for this. A flashing victory! They must fear us now! Your will shall oh, be I really want to take Palanga, but I, I just don't know what's out there. I, I just can't justify risking these guys. God's servant, 
Well, you know what? Maybe I can. Fuck it. Fuck it. Sometimes you gotta take a risk. We gotta get more territory, and we gotta stop them from getting territory. They'll either sally out or they won't. I don't know. We'll find out. So, fingers crossed. Uh, I might be able to handle that. I mean, we've got four units in there. To the walls! Our enemy has laid siege! And trading Palanga for Thorn. Yeah, I don't know. Alright, cool. So we'll definitely win this battle. It's just a matter of how many casualties we're going to take in terms of generals. Are we going to lose any of them or will we get through this alright? Oh shit, Any reinforcements. Well, our reinforcements are a while away. We've got to get moving. Try and meet us halfway. So the enemy general's bodyguard isn't going to catch us. Oh, what is that, a faction leader or heir? Mm. So, well, we've got one as well. Well, faction leader and heir and... Dude. Yeah, get him away from their infantry. Shit. Fuck. Slow down, slow down, slow down. Oh, Lord Fucking Ray, hell, there's always a risk. God damn it. For defeat, seems almost certain. They just didn't get there in time. Fuck. Like I said, it was always a risk doing this. You got charged right into him. God damn it. But still, getting another general will allow us to... Uh, that's right, getting this settlement will allow us to, to, to get more generals, which is pretty good. Oh, that sucks so bad. Maybe I should have had somebody else do it, like this guy. It wouldn't have mattered if he died. He wasn't even near as good of a general. Oh well. The decisions have been made. Our army is tiring. At the end of the day, it shouldn't slow us down too much. Alright, we just gotta get rid of these Latvian crossbows. Our ally. The enemy oh my are god, we lost bloody. two. They have lost half their men. We lost two generals on that. But we'll get we'll get men of the hours the and stuff like that, so it's okay. In our favor. All civilized oh, jeez, I just realized. If he dies, no one's besieging the settlement. They oh, they still did it anyway. Good. Death. God damn it. These people will bow to you as their lord. So yeah, we'll still get someone to replace him, but... Oh, that stung. Still, we got Palanga. <sighs> Risks had to be made. Risks had to be made. There's no choice. Ah, uh, the faction air died as well, so we got this other guy. Well, whatever. Orders, my lord. Anyway, we took it. So looking at this region here... Oh, God, they got two generals. I don't know if we'll easier, win that. Yes? Alright, what do they got over here? Do that with two. Maybe if I had three, I could have. Well, hang on a second. I might be able to win that. Okay, so this time, this time, don't. Well, actually, he's got some dread. He's not so bad. Oh, but he hasn't got any movement. We'll have to wait till next turn. Alright, we've got a bit more money as well, so we can build some stuff. This region could really use more of this. Are we going to be able to hold Thorn? Let's see what we're going to yes. be up against, firstly. Moving to engage. Okay. Lots of infantry, okay. Well, I'll just do the best I can, but I'm not sure if I can win that. <laughs> okay. 
Those two generals are definitely going to be a problem. Same with those guys there. Alright, well, like I said, I'll just do the best I can. It says it's one to one, but we are badly outnumbered. My lord, the tide of battle seems to have turned against us. We must act and halt this turn of events. Okay. So, how are we going to do this? We've got letters coming in from over here. Damn it. It's going to be tricky no matter which way we pull it. I'm thinking what we'll do is stay at the town square. Because if they if they charge at us from here, they're not going to bring the general's bodyguard in right away. But if we stay here, the general's bodyguard might be the first in here. If we kill the general's bodyguard, we win. Also, from here, we can't, we can't break. Now, we could set up some cavalry, uh, some archers here and here to shoot down on them. That could work. Maybe what you should do is just stand here, just for the time being, just so the towers shoot. And fuck it, if we kill five men, it's better than nothing. Uh, should we? S don't fire yet, because you're gonna get terrible shots in. The enemy have ladders right, at the wall. Get back Repel here the attackers. Give them steel. Shouldn't need skill drop. General, the enemy's ram has breached the gates. The enemy siege tower has reached our walls. So how many God of them died? Our swords sharp. Yeah, the walls are get no longer five. ours. Oh, the enemy have taken them. Alright, here we go. Yeah, so the general's bodyguards, here they come. Alright, go to skill troop. Start firing at him. <laughs> Plan going well. Alright, well that's, that's step one. We still have to win. It's not over yet. Our guys will not break. So he's still going to take out these generals' bodyguard. They're not going to break so easily either. Uh, where are they? are they? If they come around over this way, we're in a bit of trouble. No, they're not. Okay, good. Shoot the Summer Goshen accent, man, because our guys are going to struggle with them. Alright, you can get our skills from now. Maybe you shoot this one here. He should have a better angle on those ones. 19 to 19, it's evenly matched. Except we have a morale advantage. Good, the other enemy general's dead as well. Even if we lost this, at least we killed both of their generals. Hit them up with a flanking move here. Good to make him break. Okay, get our skill troop. Okay, now pull back to here because I still want to keep shooting them with the with the archers. It's working out reasonably well. Bouncer power is evenly matched, 30 to 31 percent. It's okay. And this can be retrained. Hopefully, we've got enough money to do so. Certainly would be nice if we captured more of them, but yeah, what can we do? Okay, so yeah, their their archers are now giving us problems. Let's get in over here to try to draw their archers closer. Holy 
It's okay, it's only temporary. Our enemy is in control of the castle. Ah, shit. Good news! The enemy is no longer in command of the castle. Fuck. My lord, only half of our force remains. Yeah, the enemy archers are giving us a hard time now. So we're, we're technically losing by a small margin. Even though we've killed the enemy general, it's just not quite enough. Only half the enemy force remains. They just keep coming back, so might as well shoot them in the back. Go ahead and get those Baltic arches now. I think we'll, I think we'll win. Yeah, without their archers shooting us, we're okay. I think their archers were doing the most damage to us. The battle seems to be swinging in our favor. From such tidings does victory emerge. The battle is very much in our favor. The enemy army runs. We must per right. All civilized peoples will It's good be they lost most of their men. We, um, here today. we may have actually wiped them out as well. The thing is though, it could actually be like 84.9%, in which case it wouldn't get wiped out. No, no. The enemy Hard to say. We are victors. Four units of order spearmen at our capital, which is Thorn. All right, so all of those those guys My were Lord. replaced, and retrain those archers. Cool. So Thorn's looking like it can defend itself now. Good. All right. Okay, we've made progress, you know. Well, sort of. I mean, that, that someone was lost. Well, he lost that, so it wasn't me. Alright, so over here, they recruited some more men. I need... I need another settlement so that we can get more generals. We've only got two. They've still got a lot of troops here. I look forward to fighting. Those guys don't really concern me too much. Alright, regardless of what, what's here, let's do a, uh, a little bit of buggery here. Ah, oh, shit. I don't know what's there. My lord. I will get. I'm just deciding whether I should even go there. I look forward to fighting you. Are you a night fighter by any chance? No. Alright, why don't you check to see what yes. they've got. Marching to battle, pride, Lord. A lot of Tartar Lancers. You know what, I think I might actually be able to win the battle there. So I'm going to send just the cavalry because the infantry won't be able to participate in the attack. Yes. And I think I can win this. Leave your mercy behind, men. Hmm. What if we were to go over to uh, Gotland or whatever it's called? I can't remember. Visby, is it? I can't remember. Take that. That's a good settlement. And, um. Lithuania won't bother us. Okay. Okay. Here's what, no, no. Here's what we should do. Don't worry about the Kumid Horse Archers to begin with. They're just going to annoy us. 
Have them on this side here, shooting at the heavily armored units, while you guys go around the flank here. Get ready to run them down. Uh, feign a charge in on them, but really, we're going to be focusing on the Tartar Lancers. So let's, let's hopefully not lose both of our generals on this, because that would be game over. But we need to take risks. Okay, that's good. Good, capture as many of them as you can. Hey, good job. I wasn't expecting that. Oh, for fuck's sake. Look, as long as I don't lose both the of the generals, is very much fine. in our favor. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. <laughs> Fucking idiots. Alright, we got him. Like oh, and we've got him surrounded the too. Wipe him out, wipe him out. They have lost half their men. Our men have captured the enemy general. Guard him well, so he can see us defeat the rest of his army. Hmm, we might actually just get 85% on this, because we wiped out two of their units completely. Look how our cowardly foe runs! It is time to press the attack! Very hard to tell if we did or not. It'll be close. But still, we, we definitely got the better of them. We barely lost anything on that. Are these guys fast moving? No. You just let yourself get surrounded Our there. Our men are winning the battle. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Somebody slipped away from us. Oh, hang on, well, just get him after all. Good. You just keep in combat with them. I need you over here. What is this? That fin crossbows take them out. Good, good, good. Just stay, stay clear of them. Sit, deal with them last. Over here. Try and flank this guy to make him break. Stay away from them. Goddamn slowpoke. Army is tiring. Oh, fuck's sake. <laughs> oh well. We'll get another one for free. God damn it. This guy here is winning against two of our guys. So we're gonna break him. Now the two shot I got is getting wrecked. My lord, the enemy are badly bloodied. They as long as we don't lose him, so keep, keep him out of all combat now. Because if we lost him, that's it. It's game over. God, I'm losing a lot of generals today. Our men have slain the enemy general. Without him, his troops will lose their will to fight. Yeah, so obviously use him because he's dead anyway. I think we wiped out this this first army. Oh, sorry, this is the reinforcing one. Uh, damn, charging head on into them. I don't know. Doesn't matter, but this unit here gets completely wiped out anyway. I'd love it if we actually took the settlement with a false draw out. But no, it's just a regular draw out, but still. You stay in combat there. Don't you dare die on this charge. The battle is very much in our favor. If we remain true and steadfast, fucking hell, these guys are bloody insane. <laughs> God. Just a few more of them to go. The 
enemy army runs, this is a clear victory. All right, let's have a look at this. That, that army there is definitely dead, but I'm not sure about them. We killed 91%. Oh, please let us get into the settlement without a siege. That would just be amazing. I deserve it. Give it to me. Yes. Good, I was worried about that one. I had the reinforcing army. We definitely died. So we lost a we lost a general, but we gained a city. A crushing victory! They must fear us now. I will make them fear. And with four cities now. We march to our enemy's doom. They so looking at him, uh, he probably got a little death. bit of extra dread from that. Their Good. doom has befallen them. I have taken their lands. Orders, my king. Alright, so I'm thinking I might head over here to to Aronsburg. Alright, so yeah, they should give us an adoption candidate over the intern. Alright, financially, we're, we're doing well. Okay, things are going to start to... Look, sacrifices had to be made. It would have been better if they didn't die, but sacrifices had to be made to get to this point. We're at four settlements now where I'm feeling a lot more comfortable, apart from, you know, the fact that we could end up with faction leader death. Uh, sword brethren, yeah, grab some of them. Cool, we got still got a bit of extra money. Any missions? Nope. So yeah, it's not well defended. That's good. Okay, yeah, 3,200 a turn. Cool. Doesn't seem like there's that many Lithuanians in the area at the moment as well, so hope, well, apart from the forces here. If they attack Konigsberg, we should be okay. Alright, let's move on. Actually, what I'll do... No, no, I'll just move on. Good. So he should have ended up over here, because he... Yep. So yeah, it didn't matter that much that the guy died. The old order must be purged so that the new order can begin. Alright. They're just standing around here causing devastation, it's fine. Blockade the port of Riga. Uh, I'd be... Willing to, how long does it want me to do that for? For at least two turns. Okay, well, let's get these guys over to, to Aaronsburg first. Done. Set sail. We shall not relent, ever! Yes. As ordered. My Good. lord. Your will shall be obeyed. Orders, my king. What's in there? Good, just yes, a general bodyguard. That's nice and easy. Vertical. And then I'll get you over here to, to do that. I'll recruit another boat. And some more... Tomorrow. Some more troops. Okay. I think our settlements are well enough defended for the time being. But I still want more, so keep getting it. Good. Now that we have more settlements, we can actually increase the number of of generals' bodyguards, or just generals that we have. So he went to Thorn. Yeah, of course, because that's the capital. Good. Good. Da. We have the port blockaded now, Lord. Alright, let's do this. Should be an easy order to resolve. Just because it's a... Hang on a second. I might be able to do this without taking a single casualty by just putting units in the town square. And even if that doesn't work, he'll he'll beat the general's bodyguard. 
These auto spearmen are some of the best spearmen in the game. Our men have reached the walls with their ladders. Our soldiers have proved their worth today. The enemy's walls belong to us now. Oh, you almost made it up. So whatever. Okay, so now if we just stand here, make sure that you stand close by. It's not letting us. Come on. Just a little bit closer. Because I might just need like a couple more guys in here. Just don't touch him. Oh shit. Let's get another unit of cavalry. I'm sure it's just like one or two more men in here and it'll sort it out. As I said before, anything that we can do to just Praise get free the kills, don't, don't touch them. Don't touch them. Just stare at each other. Don't touch them. Stop it. Stop moving. Stop it. Stop it. Come on, you've only got 50 seconds. Stop it. Fucking idiots. Battle is very much in our favor. If oh, well. we remain true and steadfast, still, still get it this way, but it costs us some casualties. A crushing victory! They good. must fear us good, now. Good. These people will bow to you. All right, yeah, because we were already at war with uh, Novgorod as well, so attacking them seemed like a, a thing to do. Alright, what can we recruit here? Yeah, get some of them. My lord. Da. Yes, my lord. Oh, uh, I should Careful. actually go back and bring some more troops over. We should hit this next. Part of me is tempted to hit Revel. Be a relatively wealthy settlement. All right. uh, we don't have any more money. But you know, we're capturing settlements that are making good cash. We've got five now. We, we might even get another another family member adoption next turn. Right, moving on. So yeah, Poland and Lithuania are also fighting each other. So that takes a little bit of the stress off us. Okay, at least it didn't succeed. Ready to trade. Well, that was actually quite fortunate. Ready to trade. Uh, we're not going to win in that business situation. Opportunity? I mean, he can sit there and keep trying to make 143 and die, or he could let the, let's just let the guy fucking have it and keep making shit money. On my way. I mean, he'll probably still come after Setting us anyway. But whatever. How may, God. How may I serve? Does this heritage go to heaven? God serve. Oh well. So, one more turn of blockade, and it should be fine. My lord. Set sail. Yes. It doesn't look like anyone's coming to Window yes. at the moment. Move out. Yes, my lord. Your Ooh, we got three generals here. We shouldn't need to my leave lord. a governor. Public order is good. I will make them fear you. All right, so Rolling next turn we'll head over to here and besiege it.
If I'm not concerned if they attack us, that's we should be able to handle that. Come closer. Yes. Okay, looking good. All right, moving on to next turn. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, he's, he's hell bent on trying to kill us. Well, you succeeded again. Ready How about to that? Trade. We would all welcome your trade. Ready to trade. Just get the fuck out of there. Continuing on. Not possible. I shall rest on Three units of mangonels. Ugh. Awesome. Oh, I love mangonels. My, my lord. Nothing like throwing a barrel of oil into the front of your line. Oh, great units, those. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm, I'm not going to have that shit. Oh, it's probably a good thing we didn't besiege the settlement then. Shit. I only respect strength. Da. Surrender your land Maybe we should me. go besiege Riga be instead. Easier, he can't yes? get to us because of his artillery. I see your head rest atop a pike. Oh, fuck Outlander it. Scum. I've over-recruited. Battle will resolve our differences. That's actually not bad. I think I can handle... Where to? If, you know, Lithuania was to send someone else at us over here. Get ashore now, man. Oh, fuck me. God you damn it. Relent, Shit. Da. Oh, yeah. Thanks for the fucking crappy Where mission, to? by the way. Combining fleets, my lord. Yeah, I, I, I'm waiting for this to be not well defended. I can take this force out there to go and stop him, but it is well defended. How may I serve? Ah! It is in both our interests to trade. What are you trading? Perhaps I have some trading amber. Eh, whatever. Okay. Uh, well, I'll have to besiege it next turn. Can't do anything about that now. Losing Ahrensburg's no big deal. We must Greetings. We hope you will consider this well. Hmm. I'm willing to accept this, but keep me out of give me out of debt with two grand. On a different day, we may have a Yeah, uh, if you can't pay two grand, you ain't worth shit to me. Oh god damn it. Oh, that's a lot. Okay, no, it's actually not so bad. Make them fear you. It's not so bad. Yeah, most of those troops are shit. Okay, here's what we do. Your will shall be obeyed. Uh, you'll besiege the settlement, and these As guys here I will, will make them fear you. head over yes. here. Yes, an order. My lord, forward, right. your will shall be obeyed. And we'll force them to sally out against March us. That way we kill a large army. Okay, that's good. But we don't have any other intel. The army could still be there. Look, why don't we go there? If the army's buggered off, great. And if not, we can always just withdraw back to here. It should be fine. Unless, unless we get stuck. <laughs> anyway, it's right there. If it Look, is the fight um, you wish, come closer. Like I said, we, we, if they attack us, we can go into fight and withdraw it. We'll come back to Thorn. Unless it's under siege, which they don't have anyone besieging it. And the AI doesn't understand false drawouts. So it's okay. Alright. So Ahrensburg will fall, but we'll get Riga, which is a better prize. Right, no. Moving on. Got a bit of running to do to get to get away from them. Better, better hurry. Come on, For these guys need to get over here as well. Of battle goes our way. Let us pray it remains as such.
They don't need to get all the way to the front line, they just need to get close enough to the cavalry so that they back off. Okay, good. Shit, I think they're shooting. Back off. We got. They've got a lot of missile cavalry. We need the archers to deal with that. We've got to get behind the line here. It's basically a field battle. Yeah, because if we go charge over there, we're just, just not going to do much. We could take on the Divas Guard. Right, let's do that. Our men are winning the battle. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Okay, get back over here. How are you doing? You're okay? A little bit concerned about the damage he's taken, but he should be okay. The enemy general is no true man. He flees the field of battle and abandons his men to their fate. Right, so. Yeah, I still really want to get these um, these missile cavalry killed off. They're giving us a big problem. General flees like the coward he is. Strike hard and break the spirit of his army. So far, so good. Okay, that that went reasonably well. Okay, keep him out of it now. These three take out just a big old charge here, over here. We didn't kill the enemy general, but these guys should be pretty tight considering how far they've run. Not a charge. The Semigotian Axemen, they can they can really fuck up your day. The battle is very much in our favor. Luckily the archers are ripping them apart. And steadfast, victory will be ours. Only half the enemy force remains. Okay, shouldn't be that much Our longer. Our men are winning the battle. If we continue like Good, this, only eight percent casualties. The enemy. So what do we got coming in over here? Okay, their their cavalry are coming back. General is no true man. He flees the field of battle and abandons his men to their fate. And now it's just a matter of trying to either rout them all simultaneously or actually killing them all. Which should probably be the former. Solid charge here should finish him off. Finish this one off. Our men are winning the battle. If we continue, and again, like we never this, broke we the enemy general the here. Enemy. So, yeah, that's actually not going so well. Back off. Okay, then they broke. The 
The battle is very much in our favor. If we are the enemy general, please, like the coward he is. The catapults never came out, did they? If the catapults aren't coming out, then we have to get inside the settlement. Shit, you better get over here as well. The moment they open the gate, you gotta get inside. Hmm. Bit of a stalemate. They're trying to do what I did at the, the battle is very the much in battle. our favor. Yeah. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. Quick, the gate's open. Go in. We're in. All right, now we just got to take out the catapults, and the rest of this should be easy. But inside the settlement, these guys here aren't going to be at a skirmish modus. Get in there. Hopefully our generals don't die. But they are replaceable now. The battle is very much in our favor. If we remain true, the enemy general lies dead. We have sent the core to hell. battle is very much in our favor. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. Wait, wait, wait. Stay there. Just for one minute. They're not going to get back in time. This is a clear victory. Good. Now this is this should be a settlement that we can actually make some decent cash from. Ten grand certainly helps to pay off my debts. They are broken. Yeah, there's no hope there. Blockade the port of Pernau. What are the options? Be rewarded with 1,000 florins. Uh, well, Careful. whatever. Breaking away from the fleet. Phew, it's a large Danish force. To this port. An honor to serve, my lord. Good. We'll make a decent coin. No one's under siege, no and this this didn't obey. work. Well. Battle will resolve our differences. I am not here yeah, to no, negotiate the truth. Yeah, no, you should steer clear of that. We march. Well, get marching. If they come here, we'll beat them. But just let Poland do its thing over here for the time being. Anyway, we gained a good settlement here, so be happy with that. The public order's not good. So we're going to need to fix that up. An honor to serve. I look forward to fighting you. If it is a fight you wish, honor and courage, soldiers. We so it seems like we're going to have to deal with quite a lot of Novgorodian they forces as well. Have made us victorious. So what are we up to? we got five regions. I mean, defeat has been averted, sure, but if I hand this back to the guy, I'm pretty sure he'll fail. Maybe we can head over here next. That's their capital. That doesn't mean shit, but still. An honor to serve, my lord. Confronting the enemy honorably, my lord. Alright, so just stay here for the turn. We'll get some extra troops. Or at the very least, we'll fix up the public order here a little bit. And we'll recruit from over here as well. My lord. Sent him back for retraining. Of course. Disembarking. Yes. Oh, 
orders, my king. If I had a larger army, oh, that looks good. Hang on a second. That's not you how much usually costs. Ever. That's what I thought. I will make them fear you. Still not making much cash. We need to take another settlement. Then again, we did lose this one. Like I said, we stay here for a turn. Oh, hang on, this will make Ready us some more cash. Uh, yes, um, yes, I shall get down here. Place. That could be worth quite a bit. Don't want to, don't really want to fight Novgorod and Lithuania at the same time. But you know, their settlement there was left pretty much undefended. Who? What's the the Novgorod's um, diplomatic situation? So they're allied. So yeah, they're allied with Denmark and enemied with um, with the Mongols. All right. So hopefully the Mongols are giving them some trouble. Let's have a look. Yeah, so the Mongols still own Kiev. Hut. So they, the Mongols have taken just that region there. Okay. What about this one? Novgorod owns that. Okay. Battle will resolve our differences. It might also be a good idea to change Palanga to our capital. 709. There we go. And that'll help public order here as well. Maybe we should just keep moving. Let me just see. Order. My lord. Hmm. Okay. Yes. Because well, well, we've got troops coming in, we don't have to worry about them. If it is a fight you wish. Come closer. All right, let's so finish this army off. Yeah, the three generals' bodyguards should be enough to just charge on in there like madmen. If the enemy show you mercy in battle, so the Lithuanians took our capital, so we should take theirs in response. All right, so. I'm just going to rely on the general's bodyguard for this. We need to make sure our, the rest of our forces are in as good a shape as possible before we go for that settlement. Hopefully they don't get a shot in, but they probably... No, they didn't. Good. Only half the enemy. Our men are winning the battle. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Don't have to wipe them out. Just get them out of my face. The enemy general lies dead. The enemy general is no true man. He flees the field of battle and abandons his men to their fate. The enemy army runs. Oh good, we got, uh, we got them wiped out. Nice. All civilized people. So yeah, we gotta push in there. Don't even have to think about it. Of course we're gonna execute them. A crushing victory! They must fear us now! I will make them fear you. Yes. Actually, come stand here. That way you'll be we hidden. March. We march tomorrow. And maybe they'll move some of their forces out. I don't know. We'll see. Da. My lord. Yes. Of course. We have the advantage of surprise here. My lord. Orders, my king. Forward. There's a little convergent on this region. Next turn. Okay, so these guys here, they can go back over to Palanga for retraining. But not the Prussian archers, because we need to build the practice range first, but that's fine. All good. All good, let's move on. Hmm, they've left a draw out situation. Although against that Lithuania that's not so easy. Hmm, crossbow militia, okay. 
Not making very much money. And this region here isn't going to make us rich or anything. Where to? An order. Hmm. Okay, let's have a look at the faction rating, see how things have been going. So, we've certainly made a bit of the legend effect, you know, where we go up and they go down, but it's still not good enough. If it is a fight you wish, come closer. Do you have night attack? Yes, he does. Okay. My lord. Right, if I bring too many troops here, the draw out won't work. Yes. So they'll come in reinforcements if we fail. Well, they'll come in as reinforcements to the settlement either way, if we win. We march to our enemy. Uh, too many, too many horses there. That one's doable. We could probably wipe. Oh, but there's a Samagoshian Axeman. Fuck. All right. Yeah. I'd still like to try to do this. Show no mercy to our people's enemies. At least we've got some regular archers now. Regular archers are the way to beat horse archers. As long as they're protected by something. Right, see you up front. You guys behind them. And you guys behind them still. Enemy reinforcements will show up behind the them. The enemy are bringing in reinforcements. Okay. Are they gonna come at us or what? I don't mind if they meet up with their forces. Okay, they're gonna do this. Let's start climbing up the hill from the gentlest slope. Find a way to make them get off the high ground, that would certainly help. Just little bit by little bit. Don't issue the order right for the top of the hill. But go around it. Because if we fight them from here, the slope is nowhere near as bad. for some longbows right about now. Also, um, I mean, hard to ask him, but where's our free English army coming to, uh, to crusade, huh? Always love that about this campaign. Get yourself an English army under a crusading general, just wants to go and kill some pagans. And then a French one later on, I think. Can't remember though. So it's only, what, 30 odd turns into the campaign. He might have got the English one by now, but I'm not sure if he got the French one. Alright. If they don't want to attack us with them, that's fine. Shooting their Samagoshian Axemen, absolutely fine with that. Okay, hang on, we got incoming over here. Time to get into loose formation. Alright, no, they, they got under control. They're, they're wrecking them. Good. We got the better of them on that skirmish.
Hey, they come in groups of 80. Also, this is good because if we can continue to do this, it might actually wipe out this army. Just because of the skirmish, if we have another archer right now. Alright, stop that. Stop that, you're not allowed. None of that bullshit. Good. Keep shooting them. Good. Very happy with that. This is going pretty damn well, I think. 8 to 21%, that's fine. Now, if you're wondering why I'm not using loose formation, loose formation is for where you don't have skirmish superiority. Your archers do not fire as well when they're in loose formation. They don't get, they don't shoot as well. Uh, sorry, they don't get shot as easily. But like I said, if you've got uh, missile superiority and you go into loose formation, the only thing you're doing is slowing down the rate at which you will kill the enemy, because the units that go at the back of your larger unit may not be in range. I know. It's something that people often ask me, you know, why are you always, wh wh sorry, why do you never go into loose formation? I do go into loose formation, sometimes, but loose formation, like I've said before, is for when you don't have skirmish superiority. superiority. If you have superiority, you don't need it. It's, you're actually better off not using it. See, they're in loose formation, is that helping them much? I'm pretty sure we wiped them out. It is time to press the attack. Okay, now that they've lost their skirmishes, they're gonna do this stuff. Now, one on one, our units will not survive against the Magosian Axemen, which means we have to, of course, flank charge. charge into him just yet. Okay, these Samagoshian Axemen, they don't have any shields. Shit. Get out of there. Charge didn't do anything. Oh, shit. Come on, don't die on me. Go back. The battle is very much in our favor. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. Can't let them get away. Can't let them get away. So you run them down and then you'll come back over here and charge into them. Get over here. Only half the enemy force remains. We also need to make sure we kill him. If you know if we want to get the settlement this turn, which of course we do. guys held the line, that's all I really needed them to do. Alright. Don't, don't, don't let them get away. 
Look how our cowardly foe Don't let him runs. get away. It is time to press the Good boy. Good, good, good. Alright, now we just run them down. And we should have the city. This is a good win for us here. How good is the soundtrack for Medieval 2, really? It's, it's gotta be, gotta be top 2 soundtracks for a Total War game. Other one probably being run this Total War. Or Shogun 2. Ooh, I don't care. Nothing less than death. And that's exactly what they, they got. Them fear you. Mm. you gained a little bit of dread, nothing major. They probably wouldn't have afforded the ransom anyway. You should fear us coming, my enemy! Out of my fucking way. Victory. Okay. My lord. So as promised, reinforcements Orders, my king. coming in. Yes. Ma'am, march. Good. So that's a that's a good settlement there. It's making us a grand. More than a grand. Alright. And with the money we gain from sacking it, we can recruit some more troops. Orders, my king. Of course. Yeah, I can't replace that. Yeah, it could come under attack if the end. Actually, you should probably get some archers in there. It's cheaper. Replace them down here. Dismounted Halbruder. So yeah, this army is coming along just to go to wait for a good opportunity to attack. And this army is coming along as well, it's looking, looking decent. So where would we send him next? Well obviously he's got to clear out this shit here first. Maybe down to Cornus? Maybe. Of course I did want to take Marienburg back, but the opportunity just didn't arise for it. Alright, let's move on. Nice. Nice, we're getting there. Alright, if they're going to besiege Palanga, that's fine. The defences here should hold. Come closer, my lord. Battle will resolve our differences. Yes. My lord. Move out! Alright. So those guys are just sitting there and that's fine. Here, have some yes. pikes. Orders, my king. Might come in handy. No, your Here's our chance. This is what we've been waiting for. You. Your will shall be obeyed! My lord. My lord. Ma'am, march! Leave your mercy behind, men! We shall show So he's not going to be able to chase us. He's Must not able to move. Uh, I'm going to need to cancel this because the re recruitment needs to occur here. Uh, just. That'll just have to do. An order. If they besiege a settlement, so what? Better to lose Thorn and gain Marienburg than to sit in Thorn doing nothing. 
If it is a fight you wish, come. I will make them fear you. Leaving the army. We march to our enemy? Yes. Forward. And if they're unable to catch us, I look forward to fighting then you. maybe we've got them. If it is a fight you wish, maybe. come closer. What are, what are these? Dismounted Tata Lancers. Yeah, we'd, we'd win against that. Plus I could send in reinforcements. Actually, I could send Orders reinforcements there now. What do you want? Let's take my the... Lord. Yes. Order Militia. Yes. Uh, if you do that... He's not going to get there, but he'll be standing right there. Oh! Joining well, whatever, that's good then. Okay, now over here. We shall not relent! Your will shall be obeyed! My lord. Yes! Yes! My lord. Ah, whoops. Orders, my Of course! Combining troops! My lord. Forming one force! I will make them fear you! Leave your mercy behind, men! We battle will resolve our differences. Uh, should I fight that? I mean, they've got artillery. Oh, I can knock that out pretty easily. Alright, let's do that. Get him out of my fucking face. Coming, my enemy. We've got to keep weakening them. I don't think we're going to need a second episode. I might have to do a two-hour episode for this one, but I don't think a second episode is required. This is definitely unfucked. Yeah, definitely unfucked. It's just, is he going to win? I don't know. Just, uh, look, if, if you make mistakes at the beginning of the campaign, it's fine. Just learn from them, and that's how you get better. The only way you don't get better at a game is if you're stubborn and you don't learn from your mistakes. That's it. It really doesn't matter if you can't micro hard. Um, you know, if you, if you can't micro hard, don't hire an army that, that is micro intensive. Okay? Just think a little bit before you do anything and you'll be fine. I would warrant that nobody is stupid enough that they can't play this game. Nobody. You know, unless you've actually got a mental disability. They're coming straight for us. Let's go around them, gotta to get to the catapults. The enemy general fleet, like the coward he is, strike hard. And break the spirit of okay. his army. Uh, it's good. Luckily, they're really inaccurate. Okay, we're never gonna catch catch these guys, and I expect that they'll actually come back. Take out them catapults. And you guys get ready to come over here. Charge them in the rear. Let's keep shooting them. The enemy are badly bloodied. They have lost half their men. The battle is very much in our favor. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. Okay. So with the cavalry militia, let the archers handle them. in order for us to get that glorious 85% which we haven't quite reached yet. There we go. 
So yeah, All little tip to deal with um, horse archer based armies: spears and archers. That's how you beat them. Works in every Total War game. If the enemy's got loads of horse archers, spears and archers. That's it. And just protect your archers. <coughs> your archers get rid of the... <coughs> easily defeat the uh, enemy horse archers just because due to numbers. And then your spearmen protect them. Why? There is no... A crushing victory! They must fear us now! So, not well defended there. I look forward to Not worth sending you. a little bit of a detour to go sort them out. If they attack here, then we can just go back and leave your later. mercy behind, men. We shall show them none. Their fate is sealed, my lord. They are besieged. We await your order to move in. All right. All right. If we manage to capture both Cornus and Marienburg, I would dust my hands off on this one and be like, "Yep, this is good enough. I think we're done." Uh, that's unfortunate. To the walls! Our enemy has laid siege! One thousand... Well, we would have gone broke if not for it. So once again, looking at this... It's... It's, it's alright. It's not great. It's alright. We shall not relent ever. This shouldn't be a difficult win. And all right, let's do this one here first. We march to our enemy's doom. Probably not a good idea to order resolve that. Enemy show you mercy in battle, dude. The archers should be the one for this job, not the spearmen. So get them to drop all the equipment. Alright. Oh, yeah. Two archers over here, two archers over there, and this one in the center. have reached the gate with the battering ram. Our men have done well. The gates have fallen. Okay. Um, Let this guy coming in over here. Their worth today. The enemy's walls belong to us now. And we just run around. You won't catch us. And archers absolutely wreck these units because they're not particularly well armored. Let me have a look at this. They got a bit of armor, but they don't have shields. Shields are the best thing to protect against missiles. Of course, armor does help. Kind of weird what they're doing here. Alright, don't waste any more ammunition on him. He's more or less gone. Let's send this one out. Actually, I will keep you on though. Oh the other other ones over here, they're they're good to go up. Let's go. Second thoughts, they're coming over here. Move back. The 
enemy general lies. The enemy general. Our men are winning the battle. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Nope. Nope. They don't want to let us up on the walls. Yeah, you just just come over here. Don't worry about climbing up the walls. Just go around. It's important that we try and minimize casualties so that when I hand this back to him, he's got a good-sized army that's ready to deal with a weakened Lithuania. Ah, oh, shit. All right, through this way instead. You're free to get up over here, no one's gonna get in your way. Same with you. Shit. Ah, oh, fuck's sake. The wrong way. The battle is very much in our favor. If we remain true and steadfast, victory, My lord. Oh, shit. Our men are in command of the city. My lord, we have lost control of the city. The ladders are now in place. Walls are no match for the fury of the north. No, 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 no. You're not supposed to fight. Come on. I want them to get out, but the way was blocked. My lord, our men are in command of the city. My lord, we have lost control of the city. Okay, so they should be pretty tired as well. Like I said, archers annihilate them, so that's why we're using them. Yeah, if we just keep doing this, it, every volley's doing quite a lot of damage to them. Oh, shit. No, they didn't listen fast enough. Jeez, that guy over there is getting... Bang, bang, but he's, he's lived for a while. Uh, this is just peasant archers as well, so nothing to be too concerned about. A few more volleys and they won't bother coming after us anymore. The enemy are badly blooded. They have lost half their men. Okay, good. These guys here aren't too much of a concern anymore. Ah, oh, damn it. It's... Come on, you silly pathfinding shits. Alright, good. They're not any concern now. A clear victory. Pretty minimal casualties. The only one that took any serious damage was the peasant archers, and who cares about them? They're cheap. They deserve nothing less than death. They are broken. Good, we and that's another region that makes a fair bit of cash. Still having financial issues. Okay, now for Marienburg. Leave your mercy behind, men. We shall show them none. Ah, now they are doomed. We capture this, and I'm handing them back. Of course we're going to capture it, so yeah. I'm, I'm going to call this unfucked. How many cinemas do we have now? It's like seven or eight. Well, six. I can't remember. We'll, we'll, we'll see what it's like afterwards. I, w I don't think you'll be able to lift the siege at Riga, but you can always just go back and retake it. You've got two full... Uh, three quarter stacks armies now. If you can't win with that... Well, you weren't going to win in the first place, so 
like I said, uh, I've said so many times, I'm not here to help, help you win the campaign. I'm here to give you a second chance. You've, you, here's your second chance. Don't squander it. Let's see here. Right, I want the archers on the on the ladders. We'll use the uh, order militia first before we use the order spearmen because there's no cavalry in there, so these guys aren't making their full use. He'll need them for another time. Uh, there's water around. Oh, it's a fortress as well. Uh, okay. There's another entrance over here. I'll put two of them over there. Alright, let's do this. Battery-gram is in place. Soon the enemy's defenses will fall. Uh, take a little bit of damage. What unit's this? Dismount Tartar Lancers. Okay. The battery-gram has done its work. Now is the time for brave hearts and brave deeds. Alright, let's get the order militia in there first. You can stand over here. Shouldn't be any boiling oil coming down. The Lord is with us today. We have captured the, the battle is very much in our favor. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. Good, make sure you this one out. Ah, oh, he won't do it because he can't see where they're going. Damn it. Well, good job, you guys. You did well on that one. What? Oh, I brought up one of these spears. That's fine. That's fine. All right, get the ram back on the ram. I mean, uh, let's also bring these guys. Oh, hang on, let me just sit here. Just thought they'd get a bit of a charge in, which they did. All right, so we've got the the outer part of the castle under our control. Now we just got to get the inner part. Okay, walls over here, not defended. Walls here, not well defended. They left the gates open. Alright, never mind. Don't worry about getting ladders in. Now, they do have some Agosian Axemen, so maybe be somewhat careful. Stand close enough to make sure they don't break. Men are winning the battle. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Hey, how are they getting boiling oil shot on us? Shit. Luckily, boiling oil doesn't do as much damage as it does in Rome Total War. Men are winning the battle. 
If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Seems like they're doing reasonably well. <sighs> Bit of boiling oil damage. Nothing too major. Good, they broke through. Okay, well we don't need the ladders anymore. Let's get over here and we'll shoot the rest of them. The enemy are badly bloodied. Our men are winning the battle. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Fucking, what happened there? Wouldn't let me click on them. Yeah, let those, let those guys go past. By the grace of God, our men have slain the enemy general without him. Our men are winning the battle. If we continue like this, we right, will we just, smash the enemy. Uh, Probably let the let the infantry handle the rest of this, but specifically the archers. The battle is very much in our favor. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. Yeah, we got this now. Good, only 14% casualties, that's not too bad. Considering this was a fortress that had a decent amount of defenders. All civilized peoples will be all Two to one kill ratio. Victory. Not bad at all. And we've taken back Marienburg. So every settlement that we started off with has been restored. Well, it's the only one we lost, isn't it? A crushing victory. And they rebuilt the catapult maker anyway. So there you go. Get to keep it. I have taken their land. So, financially speaking, you're making about two grand a turn. You've got eight regions, soon to be seven. And, uh, I mean, the Lithuanians are still a problem, don't get me wrong, but... <sighs> That's it. Okay, so I've, ma I've decreased the, the gap massively, so you should be okay from here. And I'm sure this is going to go down even further. I did say I'd do two hours. I wonder if I should do one more settlement. What do you think? Nah, if I take another settlement, I'm I'm doing too much. Like I said, defeat has been has been averted. If you want to win, this is this is your challenge to finish. So anyway, that's the end of this one, guys. So like, subscribe, and we'll see you in the next disaster, fuckers.